What's up, language lovers? Ready for your daily dose of English brilliance? Let's kick off another exciting lesson on Snoopy English. Stay tuned, stay awesome. Today, we are going to learn cooking expressions about Iranian polo. The first key expression is, basmati rice is ideal for its long grains and aroma. This sentence explains the preferred type of rice for polo. The second key expression is, rinse it first, then boil it until it's partially cooked before draining. This sentence describes the initial preparation of the rice. The third key expression is, typically, saffron, cardamom, and a bit of cinnamon. This sentence lists the spices used to flavor polo. The fourth key expression is, steam it with the spices and a little butter or oil. This sentence provides the final cooking method for the rice dish. Let's cook Iranian polo, a fragrant rice dish. What type of rice is best for polo? Basmati rice is ideal for its long grains and aroma. How do we prepare the rice? Rinse it first, then boil it until it's partially cooked before draining. What spices and flavors are added? Typically, saffron, cardamom, and a bit of cinnamon. Is there a special way to cook the rice after boiling? Steam it with the spices and a little butter or oil. What can polo be served with? It's often served with stews, grilled meats, or vegetables. Listen to the following main sentences repeatedly and become familiar with them. Let's listen to the conversation between the two people. Basmati rice is ideal for its long grains and aroma. Basmati rice is ideal for its long grains and aroma. Listen again with subtitles. Basmati rice is ideal for its long grains and aroma. Basmati rice is ideal for its long grains and aroma. Listen carefully without subtitles. Basmati rice is ideal for its long grains and aroma. Okay, let's listen to the next conversation. Rinse it first, then boil it until it's partially cooked before draining. Rinse it first, then boil it until it's partially cooked before draining. Listen again with subtitles. Rinse it first, then boil it until it's partially cooked before draining. Rinse it first, then boil it until it's partially cooked before draining. Listen carefully without subtitles. Rinse it first, then boil it until it's partially cooked before draining. Okay, let's listen to the next conversation. Typically, saffron, cardamom, and a bit of cinnamon. Typically, saffron, cardamom, and a bit of cinnamon. Listen again with subtitles. Typically, saffron, cardamom, and a bit of cinnamon. Typically, saffron, cardamom, and a bit of cinnamon. Listen carefully without subtitles. Typically, saffron, cardamom, and a bit of cinnamon. Okay. Let's listen to the next conversation. Steam it with the spices and a little butter or oil. Steam it with the spices and a little butter or oil. Listen again with subtitles. Steam it with the spices and a little butter or oil. Steam it with the spices and a little butter or oil. Listen carefully without subtitles. Steam it with the spices and a little butter or oil. We've looked at the key expressions so far. Let's remember the key sentences and listen to the entire dialogue repeatedly. Let's cook Iranian polo, a fragrant rice dish.
What type of rice is best for polo? Basmati rice is ideal for its long grains and aroma. How do we prepare the rice? Rinse it first, then boil it until it's partially cooked before draining. What spices and flavors are added? Typically, saffron, cardamom, and a bit of cinnamon. Is there a special way to cook the rice after boiling? Steam it with the spices and a little butter or oil. What can polo be served with? It's often served with stews, grilled meats, or vegetables. Was today's study useful? Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and share. Goodbye everyone and see you next time.